three, two, one. All right, live stream should hopefully be good. Um, let's see. And oh, it's starting. All right, that is wonderful. Uh, hello, everybody. Caden here. All right, what? Oh, sorry. Uh, people were mess. Or I was talking to Colt and uh, Wi-Fi who were online. Anyway, guys, I have got. Oh, and Wi-Fi is back. That's good. Anyway, I just gotta, eh, just gotta set up my chat so I can actually see. Brand new series, guys. This is technically episode one, which is why I'm kind of. There aren't many people watching the stream yet. Oh, hello, people. People who are joining. Uh, this is going to be a uh, brand new live streamed series on the channel, Atlas, um, an SMP series. I, I don't know which incarnation of the F Atlas this technically is. It's one of many, many incarnations. Anyway, um. You might notice, uh, if you're watching this as a vid or as the live stream now, you're going to notice I already have a base. Somewhat, I call it a... I wouldn't even really call it a base. It's like a hovel where I have some resource collection stuff. Just some chests, some tools, a bed, bamboo, some furnaces. Hello, everyone. <laughs> um, so, yeah. Uh, I, I'm going to go over something real quick. So... Uh, yes, last night actually is when we started this whole the series. This whole series got started last night at around like 8 p.m. my time, so I couldn't stream, so I recorded the first episode. And actually, this is where uh, spawn is, I believe. This is spawn. We have we have a shop here and some farms. The server's been up for probably less than 24 hours, so nothing's really set up. Hello, everyone. <laughs> um, what's up? Uh, but anyway, sorry. <laughs> Anyway, uh, so I did record a first episode, which was like the intro and everything, and I think it was about an hour long, and I was going to be like, edit it down to about 15 minutes, probably. Unfortunately, my SSD was full, where I store all my uh, OBS recordings now. So there's about five minutes of footage, and that's it. And it's basically just the intro, so I figured it wasn't really worth uploading. So this is episode one, episode one of the brand new series. Speaking of which, oh yeah, congrats, I'm nearly at 5k. Atlas. How did I spell Atlas wrong? Did I spell it wrong on the thumbnail? Oh yeah, I did spell it wrong in the live stream. I'm gonna go change that real quick. That is hilarious. Huh. I can't type to save my life, guys. I'm not even kidding. There we go. That should be updated. Atles. <laughs> Congrats from Russia. Thank you, man. Yeah, no, I'm surprised how fast we got. I, th I think... Oh, guys, what have we... Do you Does anyone know what we started the year on? I think it was like, what, what was it, like 4 point, or 4,400, 4,300, something like that? We've gotten a crazy amount of subs in such a short time, it's kind of blowing my mind. Anyway, um, nerd, thank you, thank you, well, Wi-Fi, I'm assuming he's watching the stream. <laughs> yeah, thank you, Colt, thank you, Wi-Fi, y'all are the best. Uh, <laughs> So anyway, um, I want to go over a few admin things with the series before we really like get into what we're doing today. And that is, uh, and I'm going to make a video on this maybe tomorrow, uh, just because I don't really feel like I have a lot of stuff I want to work on today. <laughs> Thanks, Wi-Fi. 4.4 at the beginning of the year. Wow. So we've gone up nearly 600 subscribers in like five months, four months, which is insane. I, that, that's absolutely blowing my mind. But yeah, maybe I'll, I'll, I'm will i trying to think of what I want to do for a 5k special. Anyway, uh, I wanted to say some things about uh, this, this series itself and what's going to be happening. So, for the most part, um, well, obviously it's an SMP, so, you know, if, if you don't know how SMPs work, they, it's just survival multiplayer. And I'm going to try and do videos with other people on the server. It'll, well, talk, hang out with other people during live streams and whatnot. Uh, it just kind of depends when people are online and what they're up to. Anyway, I was more gonna say like the uh, I, I'm gonna I've got like a new schedule I'm setting up, guys. So that will be I don't know. I'll kind of talk about that in a video maybe later this week. We'll see. Anyway, speaking of that though, I'm planning on streaming this every other day. I haven't figured out an exact time, but I'd like to, it to be a consistent time every other day. Uh, so Tuesdays, Thursdays, Saturdays should be Atlas streams. Hopefully, what do I want to do? You know, um, maybe I want to just search for a base today. Yeah, that's what we'll do. Steel shot. Oh, yes, I do remember you steal. <laughs> How could I not remember you steal? That was uh, that was insane. Uh, 
count how many people asked to join the SMP with you all. Honestly, I might. Uh, I. I don't know. I, I, um, I think there's a couple other people we've invited. Uh, Megaraptor is one of the people we've invited. Haven't heard anything back from him yet, but we'll see. So he might join on in a little while. If you get me seven stacks of clay, I give you a mending book. Uh, honest, oh, I can't. My microphone's like in the way of my keyboard, so I am like trying to type around it. Honestly, like clay is one of my favorite blocks. Well, because I like terracotta. Terracotta is my favorite block, I think. Like, well, cyan and terracotta is one of them. Was this the SMP you asked me about? Uh, yes, Josh, we'll see about you coming online. Uh, I need to talk to you a bit. Also, a lot of people were scared of you joining, which I don't blame them for. Anyway, um, why would I rather have, a clay, have clay? Because terracotta, and terracotta is amazing, and I love terracotta. Um, you like my dinosaur Minecraft series. Thank you. Uh, I put a lot of work into that. So hope I meant to put one up yesterday, but uh, literally I had to spend most of yesterday putting this whole thing together and doing university work. So uh, dinos will be hopefully going up tomorrow. We'll hopefully just be finishing the barn, I think. I think I'm almost done with it now, actually. Uh, we just need to kind of finish up the last few things with it. Um, but there we go. Okay, that's good. <laughs> yeah, given your track record, Josh, you have uh, you have quite the terrorist track record on these servers. Uh, hello, everyone. Um, yeah, no, was, well, like I think I think those guys have been playing online. Like it, within the first hour, someone already had like diamond armor and stuff. So I mean, I, I'm kind of behind on everything. Uh, hi, nightmare. I'm a changed man. You promise. What's my subscriber goal for uh, for 2020? Ah, oh, dang it. I did not want to do that. You know what? I didn't want to do that, but you know what? There we go. New door. <laughs> oh, I've got monsters nearby. Oh, come on. That's stupid. Okay, let's... They're probably right above me or something. Yep. Okay, that's what it is. Uh, my subscriber goal for this year, I don't know, probably, it was 5k, that was my goal for the year, to just get up to 5k, um, and now we're going to hit that a lot earlier than I was expecting to, so, I don't know, maybe 5.5k by the end of the year, that'd be kind of cool. Um, am I going to make a castle for the SMP? I don't know, I've been trying to, and I guess since you guys are here, I could ask you guys what kind of base to build. So I've been like prototyping a bunch of things on one of my survival worlds. Um, we could just go with, oh, you're just gonna. Oh, oh, it's only, oh, we've got the plugin installed. That's awesome. So that, okay, that's awesome. Um, is this a private server with just you and some friends or we allow people and YouTubers to join? Um, we have one other YouTuber currently lined up to join. Uh, it, it'll kind of depend. We don't know really what the goal is right now. Oh, uh, plugins installed. Yeah, thanks. Uh, but we'll kind of see what happens as time goes on. We might bring in more people. We might not. It just kind of depends how things go. Uh, I think currently there's only eight people on the server. Uh, but I mean, it's only been open for a day, so we're still kind of figuring things out with how it's going to run. Anyway. Oh, about like uh, episode and streams. Colt went up in flames. We do have a death counter on this server, which I love. Um, but anyway, uh, so this is going to be a live streamed episode series. So probably I'm going to stream about an hour every other day, like I said, and that's going to be the episodes. Um, I'm not really going to be recording this series because I kind of, I, I really enjoyed how I was recording dinos, where it's just, you know, uh, maybe a 15, 20 minute video with lots of cuts in it. And that takes a long time to get record and stuff, so I don't really want to have two series like that. Plus, I've always really enjoyed doing SMPs where I stream them, because I always felt like that was a lot more fun. I thought I had my dinos gear on for a second, and I was like, oh, I can do like the super swim. Anyway, uh... I need to do stuff today, so I think we'll just start off with mining for the most part, just because that's simple. And we've got this little cave over here. Do I have, like, torches and stuff? 
Uh, we'll keep the sword on us. Uh, we got one torch. We'll take some sticks, I guess, and my bucket. And should that be enough to kind of... I will take this as well so we can have some more torches hopefully soon. And... Well, I guess we can just make some more torches now. Um, I will read chat in a second. Built an airship base. That would be kind of cool. Um, I'll think about that. What was I thinking? I had a base idea, and I'm trying to remember what it was. Oh, I had, like, two base ideas. One I'm not sure if I'm going to do because, well, you guys knowing me, you know I like to do big, grand, like, over-the-top kind of builds sometimes. Uh, if, you've, if you've watched Dinos, you know that happens quite often. Um, anyway, uh, I'm, I'm thinking of two kinds of bases right now. One I'm thinking of is a somewhat Japanese-styled base because I've never built in that style before, and I'd kind of be interested to build an entire, like, city like that. I mean, we could also do... I've also never built a castle of any kind, so we could totally do, like, a medieval village. That would also be kind of cool. And the final one I was kind of thinking was some sort of, like, underground kind of Lord of the Rings, Moria-style build. So, like, some giant underground dwarven fortress kind of thing. I, I think that would just be such a cool idea and stuff, but I don't know if we'll end up doing that because that's a massive project and that's that would honestly just take so many resources. It'd be crazy. Uh, what's happening? Japanese base, por favor. Honestly, yeah, that's a good... Oh, and there's the water I forgot to bring with me. Um, yay, more streams. Yep, so every other day should hopefully be a live stream now. So for those of you guys who like the streams, it's pretty good, you know? We're getting a lot more stuff. Um, I like how the two of them are now just watching the live stream instead of doing their own thing. Um, oh, by the way, uh, for everyone recording currently, because um, I don't think everyone put their channel links in the like uh, in our little information board where we were supposed to put them. So everyone who's currently linked their channel and uh, YouTube page, I have or YouTube page or Twitch page, I have uh, put in the description. So if you guys want to go check out some of the other people, I think uh, what is it? I think Pea Shooter is the only one who has put anything up because he live streamed last night when we started this thing. My goodness. <gasps> oh wait, because it's a creeper that has to blow up a skeleton, right? That That's how we get music discs, I think? I don't remember. I think that's how it works. That's a shame. I don't think we got a music disc. Okay, that was bad. Oh my gosh, we're so low on food <laughs> or health. Ah. Have you seen the new blocks for the nether snapshot? I haven't really been looking at them, to be honest. Skelly shoots, oh, the creeper has to be killed by the skeleton, okay. That's how it works. Okay, I, again, it's been so long since I've like done this kind of stuff. Cause on dinos, I don't really have to worry about mobs much cause I've, the whole base is lit up. Um, Japan Zeppelin, Japan Zeppelin, what's the world, this world series of streaming about? Um, It's just gonna be like, a survival Minecraft series. We're gonna build bases, build things, hang out with people, prank people, do server events, that kind of stuff. That's the plan at least. Uh, we're only, I mean, I feel like the first few episodes probably won't have much of that in it, just as everyone's kind of getting set up. But once we kind of get our bases built, figured out, resources collected, then more stuff will start to happen. It'll get hopefully more, a lot more interesting for you guys. Uh, there is no mod pack currently for this. Uh, it's just vanilla. Skeleton has to kill Creeper. Okay. Thank you, guys. Hello. I'm surprised how many of you guys are watching this, because typically when I've done anything with a survival series in the past, all of you guys <laughs> literally just look the other way, which I, I, don't, I, I do get. I've definitely cultivated a community of people who watch Dinos, which I'm totally okay with, because, I mean, it's my favorite series in the world. I, 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 I love Dinos so much. It, it's amazing. Am I gonna add water dinosaurs to the park? Uh, yeah, that'll happen. Uh, not for a long time though. That's that's ages away. So, yeah. Why is the coal block texture upside down? Um. Oh, I have Optifine on, which gives me randomized block textures sometimes. So like things will be it'll like kind of mix up the textures to give it a more natural and random appearance. I'm also not playing with the texture pack currently, but well, I don't think I will either because since if it was my own like solo survival series i'd play with the texture pack probably but with everyone being on i prefer not to use texture packs because it's like you know someone's base might look completely different with the texture pack on and you know i don't want it, their base to look 
hideous because I wanted my base to look better because then my base usually looks weird to everyone who doesn't have the texture back and so on and so forth. Anyway, um, okay. Ah, oh, this is kind of a cool cave. If we weren't so close to spawn, I'd actually kind of build in this cave system, but I don't know. Oh, true, you're all in quarantine. Um, a theme park series. Uh, I probably won't do a theme park series, mostly just because, I don't know, I don't have a lot of interest in doing that. Um, and I mean, that also kind of comes down to like a, games like that too. Um, I had Axe, I think I played Roller Coaster Tycoon once before. I, it, I never really got into it. Uh, Planet Coaster and stuff doesn't interest me in games like that. So I don't know, to me, it's like, I don't, if it's a series I'm not overly interested in, I'm probably not gonna do it. But I mean, that is a cool idea. Um, I feel like it's something some of my friends might actually do instead, uh, knowing them. Anyway, um, we should find a place to build a base. So, Japanese airship. I don't know what that would look like. You know what, actually? Um, an airship dock on a Japanese castle. Best of both worlds. That is cool. That's actually really cool. Um, you know what? I'm going to quickly, if I just tab out real quick, I am going to quickly... What is it? Uh... Let's see, there we go. And give me a second, guys. We're just gonna pause in the base real quick. I'm very professional here, if you guys can't tell. All right, uh, so. That's what I'm looking for. Copy link. Okay, sorry. There we go. So let's see. Uh, yeah. Well, I just set up a straw poll because why not? Simple way to do it. <laughs> Very professional. Yes, obviously. England's the country that once took up what 99.9% .9 of the world. I would disagree with that. Um, Sky City or something, that'd be really cool. Japanese airship fleet, that'd be cool. The Ninjago boat, that would also be awesome. Will the server be updated to 1.16 when that comes out? Yes, it will. Um, I'm actually quite excited for 1.16. I, for one block in particular, and that is just the blue lanterns, because that looks awesome. Uh, mix of Japanese and steampunk, Japanese airships would work really nice. Yeah, that'd be really cool. I'm just gonna... Okay. Anyway, um, ba -da -ba. it's almost night time again. We need to go find a place to build a base, like a starter base, because I'm not counting this as my starter base. Oh, Colt went to bed already. All right, that's good. Um, you know what? Let's just run around and see if we can find somewhere we'd like to live. I don't know where people's bases are. Medieval village or something. That would also be kind of cool. Um, Darkstone is going to be lit. Ah! I don't know. I'm I'm still just excited for the 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 blue lanterns, mostly because I feel like I I want to do like some sort of creepy graveyard at some point, and honestly, that would be a lot of fun to have those lamps for. So I could kind of make it a bit like a. I'm, I I've never actually played Dark Souls, so I can't really say a Dark Souls kind of look, but a Dark Souls kind of look. Um. Let's see. See the thing is I. I don't know what biome I want to build. I'm probably, to 
be honest, I don't know, by a coast would be kind of cool. Um, actually, you know what? I'm just going to quickly kind of see. I'm not going to go through the jungle because realizing this now, I'm going to lose my base if I go through the jungle because, uh, you know, it's just such a twist turn. Oh, flowers. These are lilies of the valley, right? Yeah, I, I, I'm always... I know more about the new flowers that, that that have been added into the game versus like anything else, which is funny. Skyscraper, um, Studio Ghibli, Inspired Building. I don't watch any anime, so I don't actually know any of that kind of stuff. But I'm more just interested in building the style of houses because I, I I find that stuff really interesting. That's a cool place, but I feel like someone's definitely taken that already, which would be very unfortunate. Airship doesn't have to be steampunk, you can make it a fantasy year. Yeah, like, uh, like what is it? Uh, in Elder Scrolls, the Dwemer, which are Elder Scrolls dwarves, have uh, these really cool looking airships. Granted, they're kind of steampunk, but they're still pretty fantasy inspired, which I like. Man, I'd, I'd love to build a Dwemer base if I could. That would be really, really cool, I think. Um, but maybe we'll wait. I might wait and see, because we don't know. Um, I'm, I guess I should preface this. We don't know how long the series is going to go for. Um, I think the current plan is at least six months we're going to keep the server going, um, if not longer. Uh, but that kind of, for me, that kind of flashbacks to Skyrim video. That's from 2016. That was four years ago? Really? No way. Uh, it's a cool new series. Uh, do I have Tree Capitator on? No, we don't have any mods or anything. We have a few plugins, though, which I found out. I like this area. Oh, there's a, there's a village here. This might be the... Village A you've raided. The cat one, yeah, that's the live stream. Oh boy, forgot about that thing. Try a Japanese village if you can. Oh no, this is a village I came to, I think. We could actually just, you know what? Um, Oh, this no, this is somebody's base, I think. Oh, it's P's base. Oh, he's got a super smelter already? Dang, that's impressive. Um, I was gonna say like, we could definitely renovate this entire village, but if this is someone's base already, I don't wanna do that. Um, I'm liking I'm liking this like traditional forest though. We could definitely do something with this. Uh, let's find a good place and then we'll set up we'll set up shop and start moving some of our stuff over here. Um, I, I want to be closest to spawn, closest to other people, but obviously not too close. That way we have room to expand and stuff like that. Um, Skyrim inspired would be awesome. Yeah, no, maybe we'll see if we can do that in the future. I mean, granted, you know we can, oh sweet. How do I oh you need silk touch for bees, don't you? How do I, I think I need uh, glass bottles to get that. Oh, that's cool. Um, I need Silk Touch, I believe, to get the actual beehive. So we can't take that one right now. And whoa, that is a pretty looking mountain. That's actually a really nice looking mountain here. What do you guys think of this? Like right over here. Oh, hello, Mr. Bumblebee. What do you guys think of for here as the base? We got a little river here. We got some nice hills. Uh, it's actually a We'd have to do a tiny bit of terraforming, I think, to kind of flatten the area out, smooth it. But I mean, that's on par for any series I do. But those mountains look really nice. That's your crapitator plugin. Oh, that's cool. I don't know if we'll put that on. We'll see. Do I know how to build a creeper farm? Uh, I don't know how to build creeper farms. I know how to build mob farms, and we'll definitely be doing. See, this series is also something where I'm gonna do one where I'm gonna do a lot of stuff I wouldn't normally do on dinos because dinos, it's like, oh, you know. Focusing more on the park. This is going to be me focusing a lot more on building lots of farms and structures and just kind of random things I enjoy. Um, maybe this side will be a bit better. We'll see. Um, okay, because this has still got the mountains, but that's a lot flatter. And that would definitely be a lot easier for building a village on. And then we could have, we could build like some sort of stronghold or something up here, maybe. Or we could just straight up build a village up here. That would be kind of cool. Um, let me know. What are you guys thinking? What do you guys think of this? Ooh. This actually right here. This plains area. Let's head down there real quick. I mean, this this first stream episode thing is just going to be a lot of exploration where we kind of figure out where we're going to live, I guess. So many people building villages. Dang. I know. <laughs> oh, yep. I think this is it. I think this is the area. What do you guys think? Well, I do a live stream for 5k subs. I don't know what I'm doing for 5k subs. It might be a live stream. It might just be like a special video. We'll kind of see what happens. 
I think this is it, guys. I think this is the area. We got we got nice trees over there. We got a spruce forest over here. We're right by the mountains. We could build like a temple on the top of that mountain. Yo, that would actually be so cool, I think. Yeah, we could build a temple up there and maybe we could build like an ancient dwarven mine or something underneath it. That'd be kind of cool, I think. Yeah, this looks nice. You guys like this area? Okay, good. Sorry, I was, uh, someone messaged me, so I was like trying to check out what that was. Um, yeah, okay. So this will be it. This will be it. I think we should build like a. See, we need like a house, I guess. Oh, I should definitely like somewhat mark down the coordinates for myself, so that way I know where. You know where we we live, and I should probably build a sign saying that this is Caden's area. A Chinese temple would be really cool. Uh, build the base in the mountain, like the OG survival series. Oh my gosh. Honestly, I would be kind of tempted to do that. But I'm not going to. I'm not going to, uh, Josh. Well, maybe I will. We'll see what happens. A mountain would look a great place for a castle. Yeah, a castle or a temple or something like that. A steam vent under your house. You don't want to build a steam vent. Why? What are you talking about, Colt? I don't know. He's probably got some half-cooked plan that'll be like, oh, I'm going to build like a thing. That is not what I wanted. We're going to put this on top of the crafting table and just... Caden's base. And that's all we have for right now. Um, Actually, we're going to build a chest just to chuck most of our stuff in for now. Kind of just don't dig down. Oh, Colt, don't dig under my base. That's uh, some... For those of you who don't know Colton, he does a lot of mole man stuff. That has to be six years ago. It on it? No, I don't think it's six years ago, Josh. I think it's like four, four or five years ago. I think four years ago is when that series was. Dang, though, that was ages ago. Caden or Caden? Uh, K A D E N. That's my name. But honestly. No one ever says it, spells it correctly, so I honestly don't care anymore. Like, my entire life, no one outside of my family usually spells it correctly, so it's like, it doesn't bother me anymore. Um, but what are we doing? I have to go find the other base real quick, and that's a problem. Because I get lost easily, and I definitely should have marked down the uh, coordinates, but I forgot to. But that'll be okay. I kind of, I kind of actually have a vague idea of where I'm going. Which is weird for me to say, I guess. Fossils in Archaeology 7.3 release. Dang, that was ages ago. Wow. Uh, can you join Nightmare? Uh, probably not. Uh, we're we're kind of being selective with who's joining right now. Uh, we'll see. Uh, we're not currently inviting any more people at the moment, uh, and any more people we bring will probably be other streamers slash YouTubers. I think this is the correct way to go. Is it? Well, I, I guess I should just follow the mountain because I, I found the mountain which led to the village, which was in a spruce forest, and there's a pumpkin here. I should take the pumpkin just so we have like an extra bit of the stuff to farm with. Um, I don't know, I, I like this though. Like some people, like some of my friends don't like uh, not having maps or coordinates and stuff like that, telling them where to go. But I kinda, I kind of enjoy that, especially like when you're starting off on a server. Oh, that the update video, yeah, was that the, yeah, that video. <laughs> that was, that was a while ago now. It's kind of crazy that was that long ago. Um, but anyway, like my friends, they love having mini maps to tell them where to go and I don't know especially starting off with an SMP I always love not having mini maps oh whose base is this see that's the other thing I love about this is you start to just randomly find people's houses also maybe we should just take a shovel or something and just kind of create a pathway over to our build I think this is hyper's base if I had to warn to guess because yo there's a horse there. that's a cool looking horse okay I think yeah we're like right over by spawn now but like just take a shovel out and build a path like just draw out a pathway basically to my house because I'm like that would that'd be an easy way to just kind of know where my base is and I think if I just kind of walk around here there's spawn yep so I'm just over that hill um <laughs> dead homing pigeon 
Yeah, I, my directional sense of this game, it's either really, really great. Oh, thank you, Colt, for sleeping. Um, my directional sense is either amazing or it's the worst ever. Uh, it just depends on like the day. Also, I was gonna, I was just about to like think about dismantling the entire base thing we've got set up down here, but I kind of want to leave it because I don't know. Part of me feels like, you know, at least right now I don't need it, but you know, it could be kind of cool. Come back in like twenty or something episodes, and it's still here. I don't know. Seems cool to me, uh, but we uh, we can leave all the beds in here. I just mostly want like chests and useful things. So we'll take some of these chests here to just kind of give us a bit of extra storage to start off with. And hopefully we can get a house started today. If I stream slash episode five, I should start making a mega base. Uh, that's part of the plan, hopefully. I'd, I'd like to... Well, a mega, my idea of my mega base, quote unquote, is more of, I oh, can get rid of the raw pork chop, that, I mean, to be honest, this is most of the stuff, uh, do I need pumpkin, really? Okay, we'll take the crafted tables, in all honesty, and actually, you know what, we can just, I'm just going to pick up all this stuff and just kind of chuck it in this last chest we're going to leave, um, just going to take some of the stuff I feel like I actually want. Uh, we want the dirt. The andesite's probably going to be super useful. We don't really need the apple or one oak plank or the jungle sapling. Uh, we don't have anything in there. And then I'll probably take these, uh, what are they called? Da, 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 da. Furnaces, because, you know, I always need to cut a few furnaces to start off the series with. Do you choose a good skin on a horse or better stats for the horse? Uh... Hmm, that's a difficult question for me to answer. Because on one hand, yes, I, I'm very much a man of aesthetics. I, I vastly prefer aesthetics over stats in most cases. But when it comes to horses, because usually the only reason I ever get a horse in this game is for the simple fact of I need quick transportation around the world. Uh, I usually care more about stats. I, I never end up breeding any horses, though. So it's like, I always have like 15 or so horses one of which I use until it dies, in which case I take another horse out to go find other horses till I get another really good one. I don't usually care about jump height that much. It's more just, uh, you know, like how fast is it? Because the faster the horse is, the better it is, and the faster I can get around the world. And especially until like I get an elytra, because I don't know when we're gonna do the dragon fight. We should actually, I'm realizing now, I should definitely talk to everyone about that, because uh, Dragon fight's gonna be something I'm sure everyone will want to be part of, and if I'm streaming, I want it to be at a time when I can, like, actually stream the fight, because I prefer to not have to record. Um, let's see. I do love the new, I, I, I'm so glad though the server is the version it is, because it's 1.15, but I love having the new underwater blocks, guys. It's so awesome. It really is. Um, yeah, I'm really, really, really happy with that. Because it's going to make... I, I want to do a ton of pawns and stuff, like a couple man-made pawns in our base and stuff like that. And it should be really cool. And I want to detail up a river and all that. Like, I, obviously, it's me. I want to go overboard with everything, with the decorations and the landscaping. Because at the end of the day, it's a series I'm making. So it has to do, like, overboard, absolutely over-the-top builds. Because if it isn't doing that, I obviously am doing something wrong. Okay, there's the mountain, I think, right? I should build a path. I, well, I already said I was going to build a path to spawn. I'll do that. I might do that off camera just because that, or like in between streams, because that's going to be take a long time to do and it won't be very interesting, I think. So I might do that between today and Thursday and just kind of work on that a bit. Do I realize the description is saying I'm playing Minesweeper? No, I do not. Let me check that. D does it actually? That would not surprise me if it does because. I totally screw up on stuff like that. Yeah, it does say I'm playing Minesweeper. I think I meant to hit Minecraft and I must have accidentally clicked down. Well, thank you guys for informing me of the mista many mistakes I have made. Um, hey, Hyper joined. Um, I, I wanna tell him I think I found his base, but eh, I don't need to at the moment. Hello, doggo. Can we tame him? Aw, oh, dang it. Wow, how rude, dog. I gave you, like, five bones, and what do you do to me? 
absolutely nothing. No love for me, even though I gave everything for you. How rude. Where am I? How did I end up? How, I, okay, I, I think I kind of know where I'm going. 1989 Minesweeper. You know, Minesweeper, Minecraft. Basically same thing. That was my base. Oh, okay. What was the final plan? Final plan? I don't know. Have I ever played The Witcher 3? No, I haven't. Um, I've played none of The Witcher games. I know nothing about The Witcher, really. I just know it exists, for the most part, and that's that's where my knowledge of it ends. Oh, and the main character is a dude with white hair and yellow eyes. Kind of weird, like, oh, okay, we're, we're almost there, because we got the weird little dip thing. We can make this into, like, a pond or something, or, like, a, like a pool. And, yep, we're back at the base. Okay, that's great. All right, there we go. So we got the base started. I say started, our base is literally just a crafting table on a, with a sign on it that says, this is my area. But, you know, humble beginnings, guys, humble beginnings. Wait a second. No, Josh, no, no, not, not that kind of solution. We don't do that kind of solution on the channel. Um, six, how, I, why do I have 16 chests? Why did I make that many? Oh, I forgot this happens now. Um, you know, I'm just gonna deposit a ton of stuff in here and we're gonna get an ax out and just chop down stuff. Cause I'll make a couple of axes, I guess, actually. Oh, I have, oh dang, I didn't realize I had so much uh, iron. Well, we just went mining, so I guess that makes sense. Uh, duh, 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 duh. Okay, that's good. Um, whoops, I need cobble to build into two more axes. We'll get some supplies going. Um, our first house probably won't look like what our final base will look like just cause, well, actually it could, it could. Oh, it totally could. Um, I would like to use bone blocks as like the main like paperish and like our uh, like plaster kind of material for the walls of the houses, but I don't have access to that stuff right now. So instead, what we'll do is we'll get a shovel out and we're just gonna use snow, which I think was my original plan. We can make a snowman too, which will get us infinite snow. No, Josh, I know what your skin in Minecraft is. I played with you last time. You had that. I don't have time to watch the stream. It's very late on this side of the world. Uh, but you know, you're doing great and uh, you've almost reached 5K. I know, thank you, man. Thank you so much. Yeah, I, I can't believe we were almost to 5K, guys. It's, it's crazy. It's kind of blowing my mind. <laughs> That's what, like, I figured we'd hit 5k in, like, November or something, not April. Which is kind of making me interested to see, like, what happens. May will we hit 6k this year? I really doubt that, but, you know, maybe we'll hit 5.5k by the end of the year, and that would be absolutely awesome. Now, that's not a snow block. That is just a grass block with snow on top of it, because Optifine. Oh, did they change the snow texture? I think they did. It looks... It actually looks kind of cold now. That's cool. I like that. So you guys want to know a funny thing real quick? I don't actually know how to build Japanese style buildings. I've, I'd, I've made like one or two test builds on a uh, creative world. But other than that, I don't know really. I, I'm kind of illiterate when it comes to building that kind of stuff. All right, we got a, we got a few fair snow, snow blocks here we can make. Granted, I don't really need to make too many up in the mountains because, again, we can just make a snowman and the snowman will take care of it for us. So, 29, that's good enough. Let's hop back down. Oh yeah, this area is gonna be perfect. I want to, ooh, actually looking at this, I'd like to connect that lake up to the river. And if we can, because this is a great vantage point, connect that lake up to the river and cut the river through here and enlarge this side of the river as well. Basically kind of shrink that down, make it a bit of an island, because then we could put like a fort or a tower on there, and I think that would look super cool. Uh, what shaders and resource packs do I use for my Dino's World? Uh, that would be uh, Faithful 32 by 32 and Sildur's Vibrant Shaders, because Sildur's Shaders are my favorite of all time. Although, I kind of feel like I might take shaders off Dino's for a little bit, just because, I don't know, it's kind of... I don't know, it's getting kind of weird. I don't play with shaders on anything else, so I never have them on except for dinos. So then I play dinos, and then 
You know, it's kind of weird because then you don't have anything else that kind of fits with it. I don't know. It's kind of weird to explain. Anyway, um, we're just going to chop down some trees here. Oh, gosh. People are saying things. Ah. Um, bah, 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 bah. Oh, I need to place down my bed, don't I? Yeah, I probably should because then I can actually sleep here and then... Also, I think it's kind of cool, like, but their hyper's base is that direction, I think, and then pea shooter's base is that way, I think, right? I think I'm right. Uh, which means we've got two people fairly close to us. We don't need this many fences, but, uh, yes. Oh, I shouldn't put it here. Oh, hyper, sweet, hyper took care of that for us. Um, we're just going to put the snow golem up here for now. I think we can just do what like this right yeah I think that'll be good and then all right we oh and then we just need a pumpkin right yeah see I told I knew it was a good idea oh do pumpkins not have carved faces on them anymore that's cool does this not work how do I make it is there like a do I have to like craft a pumpkin Wait, uh, how do I make a snow golem? Does anyone know how I make a snow golem? Shear the pumpkin. Oh, I need shears? Okay. Uh, oh, we should probably finish off our armor. There we go. Okay. I have not played... There we go. Okay. Oh, and that gave us four pumpkin seeds. That's actually really helpful. Now I don't need to... And there we go. And then I believe we can just kind of... Yep, like that. That's actually quite brilliant. Sweet, we've already got something automated. And that la server lag, though. <laughs> um, let's make a couple more shovels real quick. Not 13. Probably like three, I guess. We'll just kind of put them like on the hot bar. Because uh, probably snow will be the most common block I'm going to need. There we go. Not exactly automated snow production, but pretty darn close to automatic snow. And we'll just use this to make another 16 snow blocks. And oh, I can probably just use the, what is it, the small crafting book to tell me how to make things, right? I don't think I have used your updated dinos pack yet. Name the snowman Frosty? Sure, his name's Frosty now. We'll make a sign for him in just a second. Or wait, we should have another sign, shouldn't we? From uh, in the chest? Yeah, okay. We do. So, uh... Frosty. There we go. Frosty, guys. He, he's, he's here. Snow blocks. Snow blocks. Okay, we got over a stack now. That's, that's pretty good. Not, that's not too bad. Um, and now we'll just kind of get a few more, probably. You know, let the shovel run out. Uh, da, da, da. Oh, shear the snowman. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I forgot about that. That's also a thing, isn't it? Doesn't it take the pumpkin off his head? Yay! I like these snowmen actually so much more. They're a lot less, like, demon looking. <laughs> you know? Give them a nice area to live. Yeah, I, I know people voted for medieval, but technically we're also doing medieval because we're doing a medieval Japanese style base. So technically I'm appeasing everybody. Uh, but we're also going to do a couple other ideas everyone suggested. I, I really like the airship idea. I think that's really cool. So I'll try and do that if I can. Uh, I don't know where we'll put it, but... And maybe that won't be at our base. Maybe we'll put that at like a spawn or something. We'll see. Anyway, um, demon snowman. People for the ethical treatment of snow golems to protect Frosty. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Frosty will get a better living area once I no longer need him to get me snow. Then he will receive a wonderful retirement and a wonderful place to live, hopefully. I just need to quickly check something, and that is how much time. All right, we probably will only stream for about another 15 ish minutes. Colt, you know what? I don't care. I do not care. They go together in my head. So 
it's good enough. Um, this isn't an actual cave. That's literally just a pit. We're, we're gonna we're gonna cover this up real quick. Just cause there we go. I don't want to be falling in there. Uh, we'll need to light it up actually, don't we? Yeah, we do. Um, and there we go. Okay. Not too bad. All right. Um, what do I need now? I think I need spruce. Um, like I said, I don't really know how to build this style of building, but I do. I did like a test build. I don't think we'll finish it. They hated each other though. The medieval people and the Japanese cult. They never met because uh, Europe never made it over there until after the Renaissance ended. So, but they meet like the 1500s, I think. I think the 1500s is when the Dutch met the Japanese. Uh, and then they brought a bunch of Christian missionaries in, which then led the Japanese to shut down their borders until, I think, like, 18... So it was, like, 1840 or something when we uh, the United States came in and was like, you're going to open the borders or we'll declare war on you and make you open them. Which, ironically, forced them... Either way, they had to open their borders, I guess. But, you know, as is life, I guess. Who knows? Anyway, um, if I just put these in a crafting bench with an axe... Oh... Aw, I was kind of hoping that would work, because maybe I can just... If, no, that... Oh, I'm dumb sometimes. I was like, oh, if I just put them in the crafting table, that'll give me stripped oak logs. No, that'll give me planks. History lessons with Caden. I, I have the dates wrong. I'm like 99% sure, but yes. Um, where should we build our first house? Why not over here in this flattish area? You can just kind of... So we'll stick one, and then one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. Oops, and then that should. Flat equals weak building. Oh, come on, Colt. Don't you start insulting my building. I will insult your building. You don't want to go there, Colt. So four. Whoops, one, two, three. Okay, I'll, that's four there. Uh, we'll need a few more logs. That's okay, because we're like right by the spruce forest, which is awesome. Um, I wanna see if I have a... Caden makes a good history shirt. Thank you, I'm glad about that. I, I plan on teaching history for a living uh, as soon as I graduate uni. Um, Cult, I'm not actually trying to fight you. You know that. Um, I think it was spruce I wanted to use, yeah. Okay. And then stone bricks. Oh, I don't actually have any stone. That's unfortunate. Um, hello, what is this? Uh, this would be our brand new series we're doing, uh, which is basically just survival. We're, we're playing a bit of uh, Minecraft survival because uh, I wanted to. Oh, we could just use planks. Yeah, I'll just use planks. Uh, what do we want to use? Not dark oak, because that's what I'm going to be using for... We'll just use... Yeah, we'll just use spruce planks and just kind of place them along the bottom. Although I'm starting looking at this now, I think that uh, dark oak may actually have been a better idea, but I didn't have a lot of... Well, I actually had more dark oak than I had spruce, so I'm not sure why I didn't want to... Who knows? I'm a weird person who does weird things for reasons I don't fully understand. Um, and then I have the snow on me, so then I think we just kind of... I really hope snow doesn't require self-touch. It does. Well, we have an infinite source of snow blocks, so that's okay. Um, we'll make this the entrance, and then... Put like a window there and a window here. Or maybe you just, I just need a shovel to get the blocks. Who knows? I'll figure that out at a later date. Um, and then kind of just, I think this wall will just be like mostly flat to kind of give me a bit more like, I can put like chests there or something. Um, and we'll stick like this. I guess this side could have a ton of windows. Shovel equals snowballs, which makes snow blocks. Yes. I don't know. Um, and we'll just kind of do that, I guess. I don't know. 
It, 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 it'll just work. Goodbye. Um, it's just an SMP. Yes, it is. Just an SMP. Um, so I will only be doing SMP things on this world. Uh, how did I do things? I'm trying to remember how stuff is supposed to be built here. Um, honestly, part of me just kind of wants to build most of this house later, just because I, I honestly do not remember how I built this thing originally. Um, what, what else did I use? I think I used an acacia door. I don't have acacia. Ave has acacia, though. Kind of do like this to kind of simulate paper windows, I think. I think that's what I did. I don't remember. I, I remember it also didn't look very good until I got like the roof on and then it like really came together. Uh, but yeah. You always do like underground survival houses. Yeah, I, I usually do that too, in all honesty. Um, I just don't, um, we got a couple caves over here. Uh, let me check time real quick. I just gotta make sure, cause I actually have something I gotta do. So like 10 minutes, you know what? We're just gonna use, no, we're just gonna use, we're just gonna go mining for a little bit and just kinda, oh, I actually need to, place my bed so I can like set my spawn here there we go because I would hate to not be able to spawn at the base when I die that would be actually really sad if that happened <laughs> oh yeah I'd be really upset if that was the case um we'll just check some of this in and eh, we got iron we can make a we can make a nice sword real quick there are sticks we have sticks okay and, and well, we'll make a second iron pickaxe, I guess. My English is failing me right now, in all honesty. I don't know why. Okay. That looks like a bad idea. We're gonna go in a different cave that might be less of a bad idea, hopefully. Uh, this actually looks like a bad idea, too. That is imminent death. I don't want imminent death. Imminent? Imminent? Eminem death? Eminem death. That, that's what we're trying to avoid. Death by M&Ms. Um, imminent. I think. I don't know. English is too hard for me. Um, just kind of dig our way around the lava, I guess. Eh, lava's weak. Lava is the weakest of all the dangers in Minecraft. Uh, let's just hop down here. Yada, yada, yada. Yeah, no, the, 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 the base is literally trash right now. Don't worry, guys. I, I It's going to look trash until I finish it. Once, once it's finished, it should hopefully look way, way, way better, but that might take me a little bit. Just because, obviously, I, I didn't get that many resources before I started. So once I get resources and kind of look back at what my plan was and kind of figure out what template I'm kind of following... Again, like I'm building a style I, I don't build in, so it's gonna look garbage. I, I, I'm I sad to say that, but it's the truth, unfortunately. Um, well, I guess that's why we're mining, isn't it? Pretty decked out for 50 minutes. No, not really. Uh, well, this is technically my second hour of playing on the server. Some of the people on here already have like diamond armor, tools. I mean, we, we went by one, someone's base earlier who has a nether portal already. So yeah, that's that's pretty crazy. We, people have definitely moved at a much faster pace than I have. And I expect them, I expect a lot of people will probably move at a much faster pace than I will uh, since I'm obviously running two series right now. So, you know, it's like 50% of the time is going to dinos, 50% of the time is gonna go to this that kind of thing um it's just we're just gonna work on getting a bit of iron set up so that way we can maybe start working on some farms next uh next episode hopefully which would be kind of nice and probably i'm gonna try and finish the house in between this episode and the next one just because i don't know I, i'd prefer to have well that's a ravine i almost walked into that that would have been actually so bad if i had um shh cold shh uh Lava is weakest of all. Caden drowns in lava. I will not drown in lava. I refuse. If I drown in lava, I quit the series. Not not actually though. I I, I really want to keep playing this. I 
I've been planning this for about with other people for about um, three weeks now, three four weeks now, and I have been very excited for it to start. And I've been like planning a ton. I've been doing tons of test builds. So even if I die in lava, I'm gonna continue. Although I'm gonna say if I fall in lava, I'm not. You know, cause paradox. I don't know. I don't know what I'm saying anymore. In all honesty. I think I would burn not drown. Drown in lava, you know, I'm sure you can drown in lava. I think that's definitely a thing. I would bet you somebody has drowned in lava. Maybe, I don't know. <laughs> Maybe they haven't. Could you drown in lava? I feel like you could. I was gonna say, technically you could drown in anything. And I was gonna be like, I don't think so actually. But now I think. I think maybe you could drown in just about anything. Mm -hmm. I'm not going to test that theory. I prefer to live. I'd prefer to stay amongst the living for a little bit longer. Um, but let's see. Let's just get some more torches going. And run around here. And it's weird for me that I'm at the stage where I'm still needing to pick up coal. Because on dinos, like, <laughs> we have so much coal on that world. It's kind of crazy. Um... But yeah, I'm trying to figure out what next episode's probably going to be. It'll probably be more working on our setting our base up, or it'll be working on spawn. We'll see what happens there. Uh, but... Paradox, that's a Cloverfield series. Ew, no, not the Cloverfield series. Or at least not that movie. That movie was pretty garbage. Um, could drown in ketchup, that's very, very true. Don't drown in lava because you would have already been dead because you would have just burnt up. Oh, wow. <laughs> How did I not fall in that? Knowing my like track record with this kind of stuff. The fact I didn't fall amazes me. We're taking the underground flower. Underground flower is now a sacred thing. I actually want to build a flower temple now. Man, I'm. you know what? I, I think I, one of the first things we need to set up for this base is a sheep farm. Because if we set up a sheep farm, it means I have like unlimited wool and then I can dye all the wool different colors and we can use that as like a template to show where we're going to build stuff. Because I think that would be really cool. And not only that, but that would definitely outline more of where the base is. Like, so if people came across here and were thinking of building something like, you know, say it's like we kind of fill up this whole little valley with, you know, little clay, not clay, little wool outlines of stuff that'll kind of set a better boundary for where we're planning to build, what's going where, stuff like that. Which should be pretty nice. Um, limited sheep equals unlimited wool equals unlimited power. Honestly, Frosty will die in the rain. Oh, he will. Again, I haven't built snowmen in like five or six updates of Minecraft. Like, I, I don't play Minecraft's updates very often. The Usually the only time I play a new update is when Dino's updates to it. And so yeah, I don't know much of the stuff about 1.15 and I haven't built snowmen since, I don't usually need snow. Although I guess I'll need snow for uh, when we get to Ice Age stuff. Anyway, um, if I quickly tab out real here, real quick. Um, but something about the same I did. Um, cast fences. I don't think I have to, but sure. We will, just to keep them safe. Anyway, um, I think we're going to end today's episode off here. So thank you guys for all for tuning in. Um, I hope you all are excited for where this series is going to go. Uh, yeah, next episode, hopefully we're going to work a bit more on the base, just kind of setting things up. Um, I'm going to try and finish the house before, either by or before next episode, so we kind of have like a base of operations to go out of. But yeah, so uh, I think next episode, or the next stream will probably be Thursday at maybe, oh, I've got to do like time conversions now. Probably like, you know, I'll figure it out. I'll post like an update or something. Uh, like a notification on the channel when it happens anyway thank you guys for watching i hope you're all enjoying uh ho hope you all enjoyed this first episode i look forward to more so uh yeah i'll see you guys in the next episode